You know, I got to tell you something to you, as it is 4 o'clock in the Motor City, and I'm being serious about this now. Hatchet is treading the line and just not being a part of this show. Well, Every time I need this guy, he isn't in the one place he's supposed to be. Hmm. You're the call screener at his show who does a very high call volume. Where the hell is he? Yesterday, same deal. I went to him a couple of times, not there. Labor Day show. We're only in here for an hour and a half, right? Doing a little holiday sizzle. Twice I went to the guy, not there. Where is he, Mike? Is he taking a poopers? No, I just talked to him, actually. He said he was putting in some Eric Ebron audio that he thought was pretty good. Okay. I, t- I told him he didn't have to, oh, but no, 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 Ebron. No, 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 see, stop right there. There's the problem. There has to be another human being in this building that can do it. What, I- David... What is it with you? <laughs> David's looking at you like, what? Literally, the last six, seven times I have needed you, you're not there. I was putting Ebron. Ah, on. there's your first mistake. <laughs> Outside of the words, I was pooping. There's no reason for you not to be there. You don't smoke. You don't fool around on your cell phone. Where are you when I need you lately? <laughs> putting in Ebron sound. Nobody wants Ebron sound. Oh, he says some interesting things today. How interesting. Why? What? We got, we got to play it now. No, no, hold on. How interesting. Well, he uh, talked about his critics on social media. He mm. talked about uh, how excited he is for Sunday's game. Oh, come I'll on. tell you what I'm going to do then. You put your money where your mouth is. All right. You buy me coffee the next two days if I don't find this utterly bonerific. <laughs> and if you do? Then I buy him lunch because that's Ooh. worth two coffees. Fair? <sighs> Hey, hey, oh, big. he's backing down already. Oh, hold on, big money. <laughs> I heard about what happens when people say they buy you lunch. You ordered a whole damn menu on poor Sully and Evan <laughs> at Terry Sponsor <laughs> Buffalo Wild Wings. That was a mistake. <laughs> you made a bet, right? Everybody else orders the little lunch. Uh, Hatchet's ordered by itself at Buffalo Wild Wings came to forty eight dollars. <laughs> wow. He, he ain't, ain't no like, beer. He did ain't not like Lomas Brown. Oh, you remember he did the trough. No, Lomas, Lomas did 10 <laughs> wings in seven varieties. Yeah. He had seven tins in front of him yeah. <laughs> with 10 wings of flavor. A big money. Come on. You hold a show out. You're not where you need to be. So now it's uh, so interesting, you got to play it. Damn, Two coffees, tried, one he tried, lunch. He tried to call you out, man. Oh, they're, they're, they're disgusting. See, if it's a no-brainer, you put the audio in. If it's something where I got to look at you like you're having a bowel movement, it's not a no-brainer, David. You know, I think Ergo, we can beat the uh, San Diego Chargers. Uh, I'm really feeling good about the ball club. I don't like people on my media. That's not exciting to me. All right. You know what? I think it was uh, misspoken when it was passed on to me. It's not as great as, it, as I thought it was. Wow. But I put it in. Honesty is the best policy, David. I put it in okay. on a word of an individual Who? that does some great work here. Who? That would be Jeffrey Rieger. He said the audio was great. Uh, and you love Rieger. He You're was, a reveling. <laughs> he said the audio was great. I put it in. He said, you got 71 cuts. Don't worry about everything else. Just worry about Ebron. So that's what I did. It wasn't as good as I thought. You can listen to it, it and, might, and let me might, know. Maybe you should get off because you do respect Jeff Rieger. And if Rieger brings something to the table, you kind of back off of it. Just saying. Maybe made a mistake. I will speak with Rieger when he arrives. And we'll leave it at that. Now, if it's convenient for you, I'd like to be able to see my call screener when I need him. Thank you. Man. A little tense around here. It's not tense. It's tense. It's not tense. I love him. But he did it. Remember Labor Day? This guy was out here in a beach chair. Wasn't even paying attention to what the hell was going on. Remember the pizza taste test? Oh, yeah. Missed the start start of the show because he was doing a goofy CBS web bit. Oh, that's right. Let me ask you a question, David. You ever late to church? Yeah, he is. Yeah. Yes, plenty of times. Are you serious? I'm black and I have two kids. Yes. Shame. And I wait on the wife to get hey, dressed? Yeah. yeah. Mike walked into that. We forgot about the CP time. <laughs> <laughs>